Hey, Kevin. So across the country, we found our most successful shop owners are the ones that quickly recognize times are tough. Uh, there may be some layoffs. We're going to have slower months than we've been used to the past several years. Uh, it's strange times. Okay, now what? Um, and the ones we're choosing to double down are going to springboard way past uh, smaller shops and the more frightened shops who are canceling their PPC budgets, stopping all campaigns, stopping SEO, uh, and just hoping and waiting for all this to blow over. So uh, there's a few opportunities here. One, I see you already doing things with coupons. Uh, first responder ads are performing very well across the country. We found 25% off uh, service, not including tires, is a real sweet spot for most of these shops uh, to garner attention. So you want to have two things. One, uh, obviously get new people in the shop, reactivate your current customer database by having them you know, come in. Maybe it's free pickup and delivery. A lot of our customers are having success with um, in fact, one of our clients in Chicago, they have three chains, uh, three stores rather, and 70% of their business are actually pickup and drop off services. So people are really taking advantage of that. You can incorporate that in your messaging that we're maintaining social distancing by doing X, Y, and Z. Um, so again, it's twofold. It's bringing people in uh, to get that car count up, get some quick cash in, but also uh, brand awareness is huge. Letting people know what you're doing to keep your doors open, to keep your staff paid, uh, what you're doing to help the community as far as first responder appreciation goes, things like that. Uh, and then in addition to that, we nurture them as opposed to just, here's a coupon. Uh, we run a paid Facebook advertising campaign, super, super targeted. I'll get into in just a second here. Monitor that to know which ones are uh, performing best. You can see top performing ads, underperforming ads. Of course, we cancel uh, underperforming ads. We look at which days of the week are best. We can up budgets day to day. So it's a really, really targeted. You can see here by zip codes, um, detailed targeting here uh, that we split test. We do all kinds of things to track, measure, and monitor what's working and what's not working. Um, and then we send it back to a funnel. So you may have heard of a funnel, typical lead gen thing. Um, we like to call it a customer generation funnel. So. You would come back to something like this and you would go through, obviously, you know, 10% off uh, tires or 25% off for first responders. Whatever the ad is would lead back to its respective landing page. So repeat the offer here. <clears throat> Excuse me, just a little social proof here. Claim my voucher for that offer. Now the person is going to fill in uh, their info. Pretty straightforward. Um, and this gives you the opportunity to retarget them in the future with different offers but you want them to book an actual appointment uh, in your shop so yes I deserve this and then we're going to incentivize them um, to actually book a time we want them to book something on their schedule uh, so we can text them email them uh, and of course get them in the shop so we incentivize them here this customer is in uh, Houston Texas they're upselling them if you book now we're going to get a free break inspection so okay great I want that um, so it's the offer plus a free break inspection and we're going to book pre-populates the information that you just put in and we're going to book an appointment uh, you can be done there and they're going to get a text message they're going to get um, an email a welcome email about next steps things like that um, and then we're doing a giveaway for these guys so i already entered that email so you didn't see the first screen but they're giving away uh, amazon echo dots you can give away customers doing a hundred dollar doordash uh, voucher uh, giveaway and this is all managed by the platform. You don't have to keep track of it, but it gives people a couple things. One, they're excited to see emails and further communications from you because they're expecting to win something, right? And this is very low cost. Uh, could be another promotion for your shop. Could be a gift card. Whatever you think would get people excited. And then they can come down here and do different things. So subscribe to your YouTube channel. Uh, like you on Facebook. Share it on Facebook. Share in an email. Uh, and the more things they do, the more chances, the more entry points you're going to get, so the better the chance uh, to win this prize. And you can set an end date. Um, you can choose one winner, ten winners, whatever the case may be. Just a little fun way uh, for people to expect emails from you uh, in the future to tell them if they won or not, and then obviously to build up your social platform here. So that's that. And then the cool thing is in the back end, it's all tracked here by a funnel. So different campaigns you're doing have, obviously, we can segment. So we see which ones are actually turning into leads to customers. Um, I won't get into all that in this video, but everything is tracked from the, from the success of the ads um, all the way through the actual lead generated through that funnel. Um, and the cool part here is the campaign that we run is going to nurture these guys from taking action, clicking on the ad, 
to opting into your funnel. Like I said, they're going to get a welcome email. Here's your voucher. Uh, then they're going to get a text message saying, here's directions to the shop. Don't forget, to, you know, standard appointment reminder stuff. Um, and the neat thing here that our customers are really loving, right after this happens to the customer, you or your uh, service writer, front desk, whatever you choose, is going to get a phone call and it'll say, hey, you have a new uh, lead from Shophawk for the break campaign, for the first responder campaign, whatever it is, click, uh, press one to connect. If you press one, it's going to auto dial that customer so you can get them in the shop uh, or schedule their appointment, schedule pickup, whatever you're doing. Uh, but the point is you're engaging them right at the moment that they're taking action from email to text to an actual phone call from your shop, all to get them into your shop to get a paying customer. Uh, lots more we can do here to nurture them and send them educational tips, essential tips for saving money during you know pandemic, what have you. Um, spring get summer ready memorial day coupons we can go as big or as little as uh you'd like but the point is we're nurturing them from ad from offer uh to the funnel to this giveaway to actually share and encourage their friends and family to participate in this offer as well all the way through the back end where we're nurturing them every single step of the way and everything is tracked so that's what i have for you today um, of course the uh, initial proposal redoing your website the seo all that still stands uh, but this is an immediate effective tool to get people in your shop paying now and increase your brand awareness during these strange times. Let me know what you think. Thanks, Kevin.